Well, hello everyone, and welcome to Medieval Kingdoms 1212 AD for Total War Attila. So, Warman, the, one of the lead developers on the Medieval Kingdoms mod for Total War Attila, very kindly has sent me a early preview build of the mod. This is only custom battles at the minute, and it's still very much a work in progress, but there's cannons. We've got freaking cannons. So, yes, I have one unit of Culver, and I'm playing as England, and I'm going up against an army of the Teutonic Order today, so I'll be producing more content on this mod, uh, over the coming days and weeks. So if you do want to see more, please do feel free to drop down a like. It would be fantastic if we get 200 likes for this battle. We'll have to see if the Kingdom of England can face off against the might of the Teutonic Order. So they've got a fairly balanced army. They have uh, some Prussian archers, some Lidovian auxiliaries, looking very nice, some Teutonic sergeants, some spear sergeants, and they have some heavy calves, some Ritterbruder, Ritter, Ritterbruder. I don't know, I'm, I'm probably pronouncing that incorrectly. But here we go. The longbows are firing on in. We're going to go into slow motion for a little while, just so I can go over my build. Uh, oh, they're not firing. Maybe they're not in range. Oh, so the range is quite small on these guys. Okay, so I have on my army, we have some yeoman archers firing off into the distance there. You, you may fire when ready. Hold the men in check. There we go. Well, they, they're, they're going to fire. Some yeoman archers, and we do have a couple of retinae longbowmen. So these are the cream of the crop, the elite archers. We also have some footmen at arms, some foot knightly retinue. And we have the late English king here as well. There we are. Very kingly, I'm sure you'll agree. Very nice, very nice. And I do have a couple of units of uh, knightly retinae. Okay, so, oh god. Oh my god! God, that and oh my! Okay, well they're pretty screwed now. So they fired off one shot. I'm not sure they'll get another one in. Um, actually, that'd be great if you could fire, fire, fire. No. Well, I'll show that again at the end of the video. I'll I'll load the replay so we can actually see them fire off the shot. <laughs> but they're dead. So. I'm not sure if I'm going to win this because I am pretty much just doing a bit of a a bit of a showcase here. But they're getting in around my heavy billment. They are aggressive little gits. Okay, so the billment will probably hold the line fairly well. I'll move the archers back. But I do have some cavalry coming in behind. Who be broken? Ah, yes. They're charging forward here. So the mod isn't currently as balanced as it will be in the final build. But here we have the Heavy Billman going in for the attack, or the defence at least. So I have a unit that I could bring around here. I'm not... You can see I'm not really paying attention. This is not an accurate uh, representation of my skills on the battlefield. Just just FYI. Please don't judge me too harshly. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to try and engage the Grand Master's Guard over here. A very beastly unit. The level of detail on this mod is is pretty amazing. Um, very good work by the Medieval Kingdoms team. I have been looking forward to this for a very long time, so it's great to actually be able to try the mod out. So here we have the Men at Arms going in. Let's uh, go into slow motion once again. Okay. So the combat animations, pretty fantastic. Probably using the base Attila ones. I don't have that confirmed. But, yeah. It's looking great. So, the level of detail is nothing but gorgeous. So, yeah. Let's keep on playing. Keep on enjoying the battle. My archers haven't really been able to do much. But it looks like England is a powerhouse once again. They do have crossbowmen firing, which could be a concern. Oh, I love the cranking animation. Oh, fantastic. Awesome. So, let's get my archers firing on their position. So, where's my king? King, you must save the archers. So the little brooder are going on in. Oh, tearing through the archers. Oh my god, they just got knocked down. Oh, 
Okay, so what else have we got on? So it looks like we've broken them in the centre. Um, yeah, I think I am going to have this one in the bag. So once their king has fallen, we should have victory. I would hope. Okay. I do like the uh, the portraits here. The character youth, well, the unit characters. Looking pretty fabulous. Okay, so the Grandmaster's Guard is going in for a final huzzah. Oh, intercepted. Slowly surrounding the Grandmaster here. Is he legging it? Kind of. <laughs> okay, so unfortunately, our cold run only got off one shot. To be fair, I did kind of sacrifice it. Uh, I didn't realise the range was that was that small. But I will, as, as I said, I'll do, I'll do the replay so we can actually see what it actually managed to do, because it looked like it just tore through. I think it might have got these guys. But here we go. So the archers haven't really got that many kills. I think it was down to the billmen. The heavy billmen have done fantastically. So there we go. We've actually routed their general, or routing their general now. Going on back in. I'm shooting my own king. Who cares at this stage? <laughs> oh, but this is going to be fantastic when uh, when the campaign comes into play. But even as a custom battle mod. Um, I'm not sure if it's available just yet. I haven't actually asked Warman yet. Um, but I believe this is just a preview for um, kind of the, uh, some YouTubers. However, I will leave the mod link in the description so you can check it out and get updates for the mod uh, whenever they become available. Hey, what are you doing? I thought I had this in the bag. Here I am just talking about... Ah, there we go. So there we have a Victor R. And let's take a little look at the Culverin in action before I uh, end the video. Okay, so I couldn't get the replay to work, so I figured I'd just load in a ton of culverins and uh, have a good time. So let's see what one, what all of these does against the same army of the Teutonic Order. So hopefully they shall begin to fire, or at least load their guns. Oh my god! Okay, so it's a pretty quick shot, and yeah. So each one dealt. I've got a few kills. I think it did better in the in the previous in the previous kind of match. Um, but hopefully they hopefully they get another shot off. If not, then uh, then you've seen how they kind of work. Um, obviously, still a work in progress. The animations here, but yeah, the fact that they've actually got cannons, at least some sort of cannons to work, in what is essentially you know a dark age game, is, is pretty fantastic, really. And now they're turning around, so I'm not really sure what they're doing. But again, a work in progress. Um, so if you've enjoyed this uh, initial video of Medieval Kingdoms mod, please do leave a like. And until next time, everyone, I bid you a very very good day. Thank you.